Hello, it's Friday and I'm finally home. So let's play with electronics. Today I will make voltage regulator circuit using this LM317. There is many tutorials how to make this circuit, but mine uh, will be most beautiful. Don't ask me why. Here is our schematic. It has uh, three legs. Last leg is input voltage, middle one is output, and first is adjust pin. So if I connect 12 volts to input, using potentiometer and a couple other components, I can adjust voltage on output pin. Output voltage will always be lower than input voltage, of course. Okay, enough talking, let's make something. First step is to bend this first leg. I will also align this potentiometer. So now I know where to ca cut second leg, which is output. And now I can solder that this potentiometer. Then I will need 220 ohms resistor. I will bend this leg. And soldered it on output pin and potentiometer. I need to connect these two pins, so I decided to use this thick wire. Okay, uh, f this third pin is input pin, so I will also solder this copper wire here and on end uh, I will put this piece of isolation so I will always know that here is plus or positive voltage at the end I will put this connector so I can connect batteries or I don't know And here is ground wire. I will also solder it to this connector. I, I also used black piece of isolation and I will connect this pin on potentiometer to ground. Now I can bend this wire because I will also need ground on output voltage connector. I hope this is not too boring to watch. I saw many videos where people are making these kind of circuits. I uh, normally I always use uh, uh, PCB or or perf board or uh, breadboard, but uh, these kind of circuits are very interesting and fun to make. And uh, also, it is uh, very easy to see all connections. I hope you understand me. English is not my language, you notice that. I am from Croatia and 
when back then when I was in primary school I didn't pay attention on my English classes now I'm also IT school teacher and kids also don't pay attention when we are learning I don't know databases or web design or something but they love electronics or robotics people don't know that this uh, upper part of chip is also output this part when we uh, usually put heat sink so this uh, this piece of metal is also connected to output and i'm using that output and of course to make circuit more stable I will add couple capacitors on uh, input we need to put really small capacitor and much larger capacitors capacitor go on output so blue connector is input connector and green is output now it's time to test this little circuit here I have this battery I will connect battery to input and I will connect voltmeter to output while I'm working it's time to invite you to subscribe to my channel please it would be nice if you don't like this video feel free to not subscribe and feel free to I don't know dislike video but if you are a beginner and you think this is interesting and I don't know and you love electronics please like share subscribe It means a lot to me. Thank you. Also, check links in the description. There is always many interesting stuff there. So here we can see that I can get from 10 volts to using potentiometer, I can lower voltage to one point. 15. I can adjust any voltage between 1.50 and 10 volts. Power supply is battery which is 12 volts. It is a little hard with with this old potentiometer but I I don't know why I didn't use new one I was lazy to find it I have so much so many these uh, in my uh, room so so sometimes it's very hard to find what I need that's it I hope you I hope that you like uh, this simple circuit stay safe subscribe to my channel Tell me what you think in the comments and have a nice day. Goodbye.